My name is Madeline and I have juvenile idiopathic arthritis. The Teens Taking Charge program is an interactive internet-based program that has been designed for youth with JIA and for their parents. My name is Alistair Dempster and I'm Madeline's dad. It teaches self-management skills, it provides knowledge around JIA and its treatments, and it also has um, a support network for patients and for families. I thought this was a very interesting model because usually people associate arthritis with adults and it's actually quite common in, in people my age, and I thought it was great that they took the time to explain the different types of J. So this is a multi-component website, and it is really divided into three parts. So in the first component, we provide JIA knowledge um, and the treatments that are used for JIA. I find that coping is a lot easier when you understand what's going on in your body. I think this is a great animation in the first module. It, uh, it explains how your knee joint moves when you go back to the first position. It actually explains all the different parts of the knee joint and what happens in a joint when you get a flare-up, which is very interesting. In the second uh, component, we offer self-management strategies to uh, help patients to uh, manage their condition. Managing stress is a great module. There's a lot of uh, frustration with taking these medications, especially when you have side effects. It's always great to learn new tips and try new things. You can find things that maybe work better or you can combine them with what you already know. And in the third component, we offer social support. There are stories of hope that have been written, videos featuring patients, their families, and healthcare providers that provide instruction and also provide inspiration. The website creates a, a great um, uh, support mechanism. The uh, presence of videos um, interviewing the, the parents and, and children, um, that direct interaction is, is quite nice. This is another good one, how will Jay affect your future? Because that's a question that as a teen I found myself asking a lot. I'll be in university, what does this mean when I'll have a job, and how long will these medications be affecting my life? So to know that there are some answers to those questions is reassuring. There's a number of skills that we want our patients to develop. We really want them to understand their medical condition and the treatments they're taking. We want them to understand how different lifestyle choices are going to impact on their condition. But we want them to be able to advocate for themselves. The silver lining in JIA is learning how to cope with difficult situations. When you know that you can handle them in a mature and effective way, it's very reassuring. And you're pretty proud of yourself once you've gone through those and you can say, I can handle that. I can handle what the future brings. So, Jay really helped me with my management skills and my, my coping skills, which is great. Madeline's right, it requires uh, maturity and an approach to managing your life that has to be consistent and you have to have a variety of alternatives. Uh, so any source of information that uh, helps you with that process is valuable.